I'm right now at Huo Shunshan Hospital, which was taken over by the People's Liberation Army on Sunday morning. And right now, I'm on the second floor of it, and 14, um, 1,400 medical, military medical workers are now busy doing final preparations for taking in 50 infected patients today. And uh, let's go take a look at one of the hospital uh, wards. And uh, as you can see here, uh, it's pretty much like, uh, usually it's like two beds in one room. It, as you can see that the beds are ready, clean pillows, sheets, covers, and the hospital dresses are ready. And here we can see the, uh, of the uh, necessary military facilities are also available. Um, here we can see the, uh, the oxygen providing system is all perfectly set. And one thing worth noticing is that all the entire hospital is covered by a very special ventilation system that all the air we're going to breathe inside the hospital will be filtered, cleaned, and then will be, you know, uh, through a very negative uh, pressure system to, you know, uh, get them out of the entire building to ensure that the working environment here and treating environment here for both the hospital, for doctors and patients are healthy. And there's one thing I want to show you guys is that look here. This looks like a box, but actually this is where the food is going to get provided to those infected patients. Inside there is an ultraviolet disinfection system. Uh, that all the food going through in and out will go through this box, get disinfected, and then delivered to the patient. And of course, when they go back, go outside, you have to go through this box again to secure uh, the, the health environment here.